Magnificent by Bradley Parks. Donnie got with Sharla. They held hands in the atrium and I pretended not to see. I was jealous, masking it as disgust. How could I dream of a future? Hands, feet and legs draped around a gross interpretation of love. Juvenile. Reviled, hazy and visceral dreams that make friends with rapid eyes, exiled from their places, staring at perfect lips and smiles. And all the while, I remind myself I am not magnificent. Daddy ran to Landry's, a hot water tasting like a puddle filtered through a long since burned down house. The only sip that made him smile. Mama's trembling fingers clutching cigs and bottles full of circles that made me bearable. Simon bearable. Catherine bearable. Floating terrible little dark wreaths, shading beautiful marble movie eyes. Eyes we share that tell a parable of a masochistic bittersweetness. A variable to the life I thought I'd have. I saw a mirror of that loving family and it saw me. It taunted. You are not magnificent. Spring meets summer's relentless humidity. Beads of sweat trickle down your neck, a pool of salt and sin. You repeat yourself, asking about the door. It's closing a deafening filter, I'm sure. Worms don't squirm as much. How jovial I must seem. Now a carbon copy in that beautiful mind. Sweat replaced with tears just as salty. And when they ask, such a demon could have done this? No longer recant the boy who feeds the birds. A beautiful speck of dust, sweeter than Ovaltine. You are not that little picture hung above the banister. You are not magnificent.